thought I'd show you a little bit of behind the scenes of all about the sew and what I get up to when I'm not delivering workshops. So I've just nipped into Birmingham, it's only about half an hour from where I am and I need to buy some fabric, one of my favourite activities but I need to keep uh, focused and know what I've come to get and I've got a kids workshop on Saturday where um, the children are going to be making aprons so I'm after some apron fabric so uh, I thought you might like to join me so I'm about to head in it's pretty cold out here so uh, I'll see you inside so you basically go in and it is floor to ceiling filled with fabric so many fabrics to choose from so you have to be really self-controlled so you get the idea fabric literally everywhere first one that I've seen it's a, um, a poly cotton so um, I think for a child's apron project I think it'd be absolutely fine but it just drew my eye kind of reminds me kind of Kath Kidson kind of vintagey so I think I'm gonna go and get some of this one this is another one that's taken my eye um, just quite funky um, I think that would appeal to um, a variety of different ages it's another poly cotton this one's cool. I think I think this might be hippos, but um, I think that would really appeal to kids. Just something a little bit different. Um, yeah, I think they're hippos. And this one's cool. I mean, just look at this. I've I have actually used this on a, a workshop before, and um, it was really popular with the kids. I think that's just so cool. Like, can you imagine an apron in that? I mean, you just wouldn't find anything like that in the shops. I don't think. So I'm drawn to polka dots because I think it's just quite a classic um, print and the ties that I've got um, for the aprons are a whitey creamy so that really go with the dots and then I've seen this navy version as well because not everyone's into sort of pinks and, and reds so I thought that navy version would look quite classic in the kitchen as well these um, really cool retro um, prints which I think are just I don't know they remind me of the 60s and, and um, 70s retro um, it, the thing is it's just which color to go for I think I'm gonna go pink in this one although I do really like the green one as well but I have to decide and um, I think I'm gonna go pink because I think that will appeal to more kids couldn't resist some cute dogs and cats so once you've chosen your fabrics you take them over to the table for the staff to uh, cut out how much you want Thank you.